Hi everyone, welcome to today's 15 minute home self-defense workout. So the workout's 15 minutes in length, three rounds, five sets per round, one minute work per set. So into the first round. So the first combination is going to be a palm strike, palm strike, hammer fist strike. So here's the demonstration slowed down. So palm, palm, hammer, change in position. So straight through all on the right side, palm, palm, hammer. So make sure you turn your body into those strikes and stepping forward on each strike as well. Let's go for it. So get in position and go. So palm strike, palm strike, hammer fist strike, turn. And again, that's it. You can see here I'm turning the hip through, especially on that hammer fist strike as well. Lead with the left foot as you step forward and spring off that rear foot on the right side to propel your body forward so you can use your body's momentum to give you even more power. Keep the hands open as well. Keep your guard up throughout. You do not want to telegraph that you're about to perform a strike so that will give you that few split seconds that's going to give you a, a greater chance of striking without being hit yourself. So 25 seconds to go. So change, change your position as much as you can to palm, palm, hammer, change position. Palm, palm, hammer, change position. That's it. So keep it moving. Get as many of these combinations in within this time. Almost there. 10 seconds to go. Full speed, full power. Keep your energy up throughout. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And recover. So rhino strike, palm strike, palm strike coming up. Let's go for a slow down demo. So rhino, palm, palm, change position. So you can see the rhino position, hands start open. Then it's immediately, as soon as the rhino has been hit, straight into a double palm strike. So get in position, let's get ready for it and go. So rhino, palm, palm, change position. Rhino, palm, palm, change position. So remember to hit through the target. I know it's an imaginary target, but hit through that imaginary target. So keep it moving all the way through now. So keep that energy, keep that focus. So change in position is obviously going to make it more varied for you, but it's also going to challenge your footwork, which is the key to any sort of combat system, is footwork. If your feet don't move, your, folly, your body will not follow you. So you need your feet to move in the correct way. 25 seconds to go. Keep it going all the way through now. Fantastic. Keep the energy up. 20 seconds. Rhino, palm, palm, change position. Rhino, palm, palm, change position. 10 seconds to go. Full speed, full energy. It's the tough one, but keep it moving. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and recover. Next combination is the Rhino Strike, Hammer Fist, Hammer Fist Strike. So slow down demo again. Rhino into the hammer, hammer. So that double strike again straight after the rhino. So just as the last exercise. So straight into it. But obviously apart from a palm strike, you're going to go into a double hammer fist strike. So you should be comfortable with the rhino strike now. So get in position. Let's go for it. So straight in. Rhino, hammer, hammer, change position. Rhino, hammer, hammer, change position. That's it. Keep that focus, keep that guard up, and keep hitting through the target. Use that rear foot to spring forward. Don't make it a jump. Make it almost a glide forward, a bit like a fencer's footwork. Okay, so you can cover a lot of distance, and if you can do that, you're going to hit with a lot more power, and also you can hit a, a target, so you can launch the strike from a further distance, thus making it harder for them to hit you because you're going to be that much further away to begin with. So keep it moving. 20 seconds to go. So full speed, get that power. 15 seconds. Use the footwork. Rhino, hammer, hammer, change position. 10 seconds to go. Keep it moving all the way through. In 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And recover. Next combination is the finger jab, palm strike, palm strike. So slow down demo. So finger jab with the left in the lead. As you drive forward, palm, palm, and change position. So getting used to that finger position, so your middle three fingers are like in a triangular position, and you drive forward towards the imaginary target's eyes around the area. Not necessarily always to hit, but just to give you that split second of time to perform the combination. Let's go for it, straight in, full speed, finger jab, palm, palm, change position. 
finger jab, palm, palm, change position. So leading with that here, it's almost like a, a, a jab technique, but obviously the hands open and the fingers are, are joined together in the middle to create a triangular position. And obviously aiming towards the attacker's forehead or eyes just to give you that distraction or even as it, an actual strike itself as well. So keep it moving throughout, keep the energy up. Finger jab, palm, palm, change position. Keep it moving. Challenge the footwork to try and face somewhere completely different. Even if you turn away from the screen you're looking at, doesn't matter because you can hear my voice. I will tell you when to do the next combination and obviously when to recover as well. So keep it going. 10 seconds to go. Keep that energy up all the way to the end. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 and recover. Next combination is the elbow, palm strike, palm strike. So slow down demo again, to so drive the elbow in, bringing that left hand to guide the elbow in, obviously to the left hand, which would have the attacker's head in that position as well, to give that much more power. And obviously opening straight up with a double palm strike afterwards. So in position, let's go for it. So elbow, palm, palm, change position. Elbow, palm, palm, change position. So keep it moving. Try and keep the same amount of intensity up on the first beginning combinations and on this set right the way through to the end of the set as well. So keep it going. That's it. So keep that energy. Try and relax the breathing. Breathe out on every strike. Okay, so you, weirdly, you've got to try and relax the breathing, but make the breathing work for you. Try not to hold your breath. 30 seconds to go. Keep it moving, keep the energy, keep hitting through the target. Elbow, palm, palm, change position. So keeping that focus, that's it, keeping the core muscles engaged throughout as well. You want your core muscles to be firing all the way through. 10 seconds to go, keep the energy, almost there. Five, four, three, two, one. Into round two, let's get in position. Okay, so into the palm strike, palm strike, hammer fist strike. Let's go for it. So full speed, full power, straight into the combination. Palm, palm, hammer fist strike. Palm, palm, hammer fist strike. So you can see, especially with that first palm strike, try and step into that strike to generate even more power and momentum. All the way through, so keeping your shoulders relaxed as well, trying to hunch the shoulders up and try to relax your breathing as much as you can, but also remember to breathe out on every single strike. 30 seconds to go. Keep it moving all the way through. Get that aggression, channel that aggression into each strike. Don't let any of those strikes be slightly weak. Go for power on every one of those strikes. Almost there now, 15 seconds to go. 10 seconds, keep the energy up all the way through to the end. Keep that focus. Five, four, three, two, one, and recover. Next combination is the rhino strike, palm strike, palm strike. Let's go for it in position and go. So rhino, palm, palm, change position. Rhino, palm, palm, change position. That's it, keep it moving, perfect that technique. So make sure you keep the technique and then add the speed and add the power and then go for it. Get as much in as in, within these sets as you can. But try not to hold back at all. I want you to go for full speed, full power, but have that control with the excellent technique that you've got. So keep it moving all the way through. 30 seconds to go. Keep it moving. That's it, keep the energy up, keep hitting through that imaginary target. Almost there. 20 seconds to go. The change position, so rhino, palm, palm, change position. 10 seconds, rhino, palm, palm, change position. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, and recover. Next combination is the rhino strike, hammer fist, hammer fist strike. Let's go for it, full speed. Rhino, hammer, hammer, change position. Rhino, hammer, hammer, change position. Rhino, hammer, hammer, change position. To get as many of these combinations in within each set, that is gonna give you the best possible workout that you can get from this. And that's what you want. You wanna to get to the end of the workout, 
knowing you've given it everything you've got to keep it going, keep the energy up all the way through. 30 seconds. Keep the energy. Almost there now. Rhino, hammer, hammer, change position. Rhino, hammer, hammer, change position. So you see it's a quick double hammer strike. And also as well, as soon as that rhino has been landed, you open straight away into the double hammer fist strike. Don't leave yourself open for too long. You've got to go straight into it. Five, four, three, two, one. And recover. Next combination is the finger jab, palm strike, palm strike. Let's go for it straight in, full speed. Finger jab, palm, palm, change position. Finger jab, palm, palm, change position. So keep it moving. You use that footwork. So don't just move the feet just because you've got to move them. Use that footwork to help you generate speed and power and to make you cover a certain distance over a period of time. The better your footwork, the further away you can be from the attacker, which then puts you in a less vulnerable position. So footwork is definitely a thing to master. And we do have a workout, a video that actually shows you how the footwork works as well. And that shows you all the strikes from this street defense system. So feel free to drop back onto that. It's not a workout as such, but it's going to show you how to perform these techniques and make them stronger. 15 seconds to go. Keep it moving. 10 seconds all the way through now. Full speed, full energy. Keep it up. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And recover. Next combination is the elbow strike, palm, palm, so straight into it, let's go, full speed, full power, elbow, palm, palm, change position, keep it moving all the way through, don't let your energy drop, I know you're going to want to, but keep it moving all the way through, keep that technique as well, do not let the technique falter just to keep moving, I want you to really focus on technique no matter what, if you start to slow down or your power starts to lessen slightly, still focus on keeping that technique. Don't let your technique falter because we do not want to train bad technique. We only want to train good technique. So all the way through now, keep it going. Keep the energy. 25 seconds to go. Keep hitting through that imaginary target. Driving forward with your strikes, especially the double palm strike after that elbow. 15 seconds to go. 10 seconds all the way through. Keep that energy up. You're almost there. Five, four, three, two, one, and recover. Into round three, your last round. Okay, so into the palm strike, palm strike, hammer fist strike. Let's go for it. To so full speed, full power, straight into the combination. Palm, palm, hammer fist strike. Palm, palm, hammer fist strike. So you can see, especially with that first palm strike, Try and step into that strike to generate even more power and momentum. All the way through to keeping your shoulders relaxed as well. Try not to hunch the shoulders up and try to relax your breathing as much as you can. But also remember to breathe out on every single strike. 30 seconds to go. Keep it moving all the way through. Get that aggression, channel that aggression into each strike. Don't let any of those strikes be slightly weak. Go for power on every one of those strikes. Almost there now. 15 seconds to go. 10 seconds. Keep the energy up all the way through to the end. Keep that focus. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And recover. Next combination is the Rhino Strike. Palm Strike. Palm Strike. Let's go for it. In position. And go. So Rhino. Palm. Palm. Change position. Rhino, palm, palm, change position. That's it. Keep it moving. Perfect that technique. So make sure you keep the technique and then add the speed and add the power and then go for it. Get as much in, as in within these sets as you can. But try not to hold back at all. I want you to go for full speed, full power. But have that control with the excellent technique that you've got. So keep it moving all the way through. 30 seconds to go. Keep it moving. That's it. Keep the energy up. Keep hitting through that imaginary target. Almost there. 20 seconds to go. The change position. So rhino, palm, palm, change position. 10 seconds. Rhino, palm, palm, change position. 5, 4, 
three, two, one, and recover. Next combination is the Rhino Strike, Hammer Fist, Hammer Fist Strike. Let's go for it, full speed. Rhino, Hammer, Hammer, change position. Rhino, Hammer, Hammer, change position. Rhino, Hammer, Hammer, change position. To get as many of these combinations in within each set, that is going to give you the best possible workout that you can get from this. And that's what you want. You want to get to the end of the workout, knowing you've given it everything you've got. To keep it going, keep the energy up all the way through. 30 seconds. Keep the energy. Almost there now. Rhino, hammer, hammer, change position. Rhino, hammer, hammer, change position. You see it's a quick double hammer strike. And also as well, as soon as that rhino has been landed, you open straight away into the double hammer fist strike. Don't leave yourself open for too long. You've got to go straight into it. Five, four, three, two, one. And recover. Next combination is the finger jab, palm strike, palm strike. Let's go for it. Straight in, full speed. Finger jab, palm, palm, change position. Finger jab, palm, palm, change position. So keep it moving, you use that footwork. So don't just move the feet just because you've got to move them. Use that footwork to help you generate speed and power and to make you cover a certain distance over a period of time. The better your footwork, the further away you can be from the attacker, which then puts you in a less vulnerable position. So footwork is definitely a thing to master and we do have a workout, a video, that actually shows you how the footwork works as well. And that shows you all the strikes from this street defense system. So feel free to drop back onto that. It's not a workout as such, but it's gonna show you how to perform these techniques and make them stronger. 15 seconds to go. Keep it moving. 10 seconds, all the way through now. Full speed, full energy, keep it up. Five, four, three, two, one, and recover. Next combination is the elbow strike, palm, palm. So straight into it, let's go. Full speed, full power, elbow, palm, palm, change position. Keep it moving all the way through. Don't let your energy drop. I know you're gonna want to, but keep it moving all the way through. Keep that technique as well. Do not let the technique falter just to keep moving. I want you to really focus on technique no matter what. If you start to slow down or your power starts to lessen slightly, still focus on keeping that technique. Don't let your technique falter because we do not want to train bad technique. We only want to train good technique. So all the way through now, keep it going. Keep the energy. 25 seconds to go. Keep hitting through that imaginary target. Driving forward with your strikes, especially the double palm strike after that elbow. 15 seconds to go. 10 seconds all the way through. Keep that energy up. You're almost there. Five, four, three, two, one, and recover. Well done, everyone. You made it. You got through that incredibly short but tough, tough workout. Very minimal rest periods, so well done. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't done already. Turn notifications on, and please share and like these videos. I'd really appreciate it, and it'll help the channel grow. In the meantime, stay fit, stay healthy, and I'll see you again soon.